Hey guys, it's September the 22nd. It's the first day of fall. I got this in the mail today. I ordered from my sister's shop. I got it oversized. I sized up because I wanted to wear a baggy. And um, yeah, it's pretty baggy. I could have got regular size. Anyway, we're expecting a big hurricane here in Nova Scotia. I, I guess the other Atlantic provinces probably are too. We just went to the grocery store. It's crazy. The shelves are like cleared off. But I'm going to show you guys what I got for if the power goes off on Saturday. So we got some bread. We got chips. <laughs> I got salad stuff. We got ham for sandwiches. We got some veggies. We got celery and cucumber. We got watermelon. Oh, we just got a tea at Tim Hortons. Mike got a chocolate mar marshmallow. I got some ranch dip and some cream cheese. Cream cheese style fruit dip. I got some sushi and I got some fruit. So that is everything that I got. Just a kind of, you know, a couple of snacks and some like vegetables and stuff to make salad and fruit to snack on. And yeah, so. That's what I got to hold us over in case we lose our power. I'm actually going to go get in the shower now, and then I'm going to fill up the bathtub with water so we have it. Well, we're going to do that tomorrow to make sure we have it. So I just thought I'd show you guys what we got right quick, and I, I'll talk to you guys in a bit. I emptied two things in the shower this time. The shampoo and this body wash. I wouldn't repurchase this body wash, but it was okay while I had it. And I would repurchase that shampoo. So I got more empties in the bedroom. Okay hey guys, I'm going to show you guys the rest of my empties very quickly. So I have this Tower 28 Recovery Mist. This was nice. I don't know if I'd buy it though. I don't know if I buy into the hype of all that. Um, Olaplex number 3 treatment. This was good. I would repurchase that or something by Olaplex <coughs> for sure. Um, this is Sand... Sand and Sky. I didn't notice that was upside down. Ashrayam Pink Clay Deep Pore Cleanser. This was pretty good. I like that. But I have so much stuff skincare wise that I gotta go through. This I like. I would repurchase this. This is the Blink Ultra Volume Tubing Mascara. It's dried out now. I can't finish it, but I really liked that. This is. The new co, this is a cleanser. This was nice too, but again, like I said, I'm working my way through stuff. And this, I loved this. The Bomb de Bright, I love the smell of it. Um, so I would repurchase this, but not right now because I have so much skin, like body creams and stuff I gotta go through before I can even think about repurchasing anything. So that's everything that I finished up lately. And I do have a Sephora order here and my Ipsy bag. I'll show you guys that when I'm done having my lunch. Okay, I'm going to show you guys what I got in my Ipsy bag. So here's the theme for this month. You got this. The first thing was outside of the bag. It's just a makeup brush. And it says it's a face brush, but it's from YC Collection. YO2 Cheek Blush. Yeah. That retails for $22. I don't know. Maybe highlighter powder under the eyes. Here's what the bag looks like this month. I'm not really... I don't really... I'm not fond of this. Okay. First product I'm just pulling out in no particular order is a hand cream. So it's from Pier Nova. Piranova Hydrating Cream and Coconut and Eucalyptus. That's a sample size. The next product is my choice item. And this is the Glow Recipe Avocado. Something. I can't read that. Anyway, that was my choice. So that was the Glow Recipe Avocado Ceramide Recovery Serum. That's deluxe size. The next product is a cleanser. So it looks like these. This is skincare heavy box pretty much. Um, that is the Meg Cosmetics Marine Serum Cleanser. Deluxe sample. 
And I have one makeup item in here. This is from Ciate London. And this is the Extraordinary Setting Powder, I believe is what it is. I'll read it off the card. So it is the Ciate London Extraordinary Translucent Powder. I liked the Everyday Vacay Coconut Setting Powder from them, so hopefully I like that. So that's everything that I got in my Ipsy bag this month. Okay, I also got a Sephora order in today, so I got the Marc Jacobs Perfect Perfume. I'm thinking about buying this blush from Benefit. I got the Shelly one, which I like, but I'm thinking about buying this, so I got the sample size when I seen it available to try it. No, you don't wear blush, Tigger. Tigger, you don't wear blush. And then, I think this was a... Like, uh, you know, where you just cash the promo offer sort of thing. So it's the polypeptide serum from Drunk Elephant. So we'll give that a try. And then what I ordered, I've heard a lot of hype about this. So I ordered the Cali Ray So Blown Blurring Collagen Peptide Primer. Everybody says this is amazing. So I'm going to do a testing new makeup type video but it's going to be vlog style but we'll be using that for sure i don't have a new foundation to use so that but that's a good thing because then i'll know what it's like with that and then i i love huda's palette so i ordered this love fest palette from huda i'll show you guys the colors but i'm not going to swatch it because i'm going to use some of the stuff in that video so but i'll show you what it looks like hold on if you haven't already seen it Okay, so this is what the Huda Love Fest, is it called Love Fest? Yeah, palette looks like. Huda loves her purples and oranges, but this is a nice, this is like a perfect fall palette. So that's what that looks like, but well, I'm not even going to swatch it because I'm going to try the pigmentation when I do a try on with it. So that's what it looks like. I just wanted to show you guys if you didn't see. Very, very pretty. Hey guys, so it's pretty dark here. It's only like 6 o'clock, but it's raining pretty hard right now. Um, they upgraded the storm, the hurricane that's going to hit us. Um, it was say, level 3 and now it's a level 4 over the water right now. Um, it's supposed to hit, it's supposed to, it was like 900 kilometers away from us not that long ago, but now it's like closer probably. And uh, Mike just went out with Odie. It's raining pretty hard out there. The winds are supposed to pick up overnight. And she was, Fiona was supposed to lose some of her power before she hit us. But now it looks like she's picking up more more power. Um, I haven't checked the weather lately. It's just, it's been messing with my head because we're not used to getting storms like this. Like we did get Hurricane Dorian a couple of years ago. That pulled down some trees, but this one, they're saying now that this is supposed to be the worst storm Canada ever had, or I guess Eastern Canada, or maybe it's Canada, I don't know. It was on CNN, Jacqueline sent me a picture, a screenshot, I'll leave it here at the end of this clip. So yeah, I'm going to end off this vlog here. Anybody who is in the line of Hurricane Fiona, please stay safe. Make sure you have, hopefully you have all your supplies and everything you need. If you're in my area, there is a number you can call 311 for like food and supplies and stuff. I've seen somebody post it on Facebook that's in my area. So that's there. But just please say, stay safe if you're in the line of Fiona. And I'm praying for everybody. Hopefully everybody's okay. So, I hope you guys, I know a lot of you guys are on the other side of the country or like in other countries and stuff. So, I hope you guys are all doing well. Take care of yourself and each other and I'll talk to you guys all in my next one. Bye everyone.